guys, this is a bell crew from Lawn Forge. I just wanted to, uh, this is what I have for, for winter. Uh, yeah, this is my crew truck. Um, it's an F-150. This is what I have all the guys, you know, shoveling, all the sidewalk, the snow blowing, the crew, the crew truck. And this is what they, they call it, the red truck. This one has a, it's a 3500 Ram with a, uh, with a diesel on it, with a chip on it to get more power to it. Um, the plow, it's a snow way. Snow is a V plow, they call it a mega blade. It's pretty, it's pretty good. It has a down pressure on it. Not my favorite, but I use it just for the fact that when we got icy and all that stuff, it, it really scrapes it out. But I got the LED uh, light bar on top. As you can see, that's a 52 inch with uh, two six inches right here. I rigged those because just for the fact that those lights, I bought two sets and both broke on uh, plowing. So I wasn't gonna deal with that anymore. I'd rather to buy those. They cost me less than $100 with the wiring included. And I don't have to worry about that if they break I just replace the light and I don't have to replace all the wiring and all the harnesses like that would happen with the light and this is the one that my friend Nick drives this it has heating pads on the truck and all that stuff so and this one is the, my mega truck this plow is brand new you guys can see that It's a whiteout. The whiteout is one of the best ones. Um, I know that Boss has a new one in it. Um, it, it looks pretty solid as well. I just like Western because I've been working with it for the last 10 years. So I'd rather to use that than, than use any other. Plus I have an audio to truck. So if something happens to one truck, I can always put the plow on the other truck in order for, for more benefits. And then if you guys can see that in the back, I have a soul spreader. That's all spreader, it, it will dump the, and then I just lift the boom, or the bed of the truck, and then all that stuff falls in there, here, with an auger in it. It's electric, some of them has a PTO, which means you have to work with hydraulics. This one's electric, uh, we decide this charge. This is my first time using it, so as soon as the winter's over, I can give you a better review on how that works. It doesn't have a, a vibrator on it, so we'll see how that's gonna work. But then this one is my gray truck. It has a Western whiteout as well. It does, this one is guy yeah, with a 5.7 engine, Hemi. It has an LED light bar. You guys can tell that if they're on. During the day, you guys can see, but that's like daytime. Guys, if you guys are plowing, get an LED light bar. Because that thing right there, dude, it will make the world of a difference. Those lights on the right here, not good. Um, I don't even know how I plowed for the last few years with it. So this is the gray truck. I call it the gray truck. I use that one the most because that's the one that I, I'm, it's shorter with the shorter bed on it. You can see that as a shorter bed, it is fast. I can, I can plow with that thing quite, you know, quite bad. With the mega, with the mega truck, I can just uh, do open spaces just for the fact that I have a dump and I have salt on it. So it's gonna be very heavy. And then I call it this one Sean White. Just for the fact that my guy, uh, my friend, drives this one and he's part of the crew. Um, this is all. It has a, uh, a diesel as well. It has a whiteout as well. You guys can tell we like the whiteout just for the fact that it goes all the way to 10 feet. So this is the, and it has the LED light bar. You can see that it's pretty bright even during the day. But it's a diesel, very powerful, and it has a V box. Uh, for salting the, the maroon one It has a, a simple blade seven feet uh, It's pretty old that the plow is pretty old but the truck is a 2002 2003 I think it's a 2003 so all these trucks This is how I run my crew uh, My guys I, I depend on them to drive them You guys can see that I'm pretty happy with the things that I, you know, that I have accomplished. I'm glad that God had given me the privilege to work with these things and and, and make me successful uh, of what I'm doing. Um, I'm very blessed by it. Um, I always thank God for it because this is, I cannot accomplish any of these without it. I only, when I started the business, I only started with this truck right here. That truck and a different plow. 
that plow got stolen so I bought a insurance pay for it so I got a new one in it last year and then uh, after that I had a, I always had my little blue truck that I bought the same year um, for personal use and then when I bought the business it was part of the team then the following year I got this one this is the one that I use every day for mowing this one I just got it last December so this is my first year where they're plowing I never plowed before so this is the first time and then these two trucks right here there are chunks uh, this body of mine he plows this is my my mechanic and uh, and he fixes pretty much everything so I hope that you guys can appreciate you know for the things that you guys have if you guys have any questions on my crew or my on my trucks how they run how they work if I like them I don't what I, I dislike uh, of all of them just let me know uh, send me a message and let me know what are these trucks you know remember that those things you do all of them they keep maintenance man we do uh, we change the U joints and all that stuff every year just for the fact that they go bad and you don't want them to go bad in the winter those two trucks over there they chunks and we run every single truck in once in one storm so you guys can see that I mean I'm we're pretty busy uh, you're talking about more than 10 hours each truck uh, going out we had to run it and we had to run them good so check your oil check your fluids everything because when something breaks it's gonna break and it's gonna be brutal so you don't want to be shorthanded all right um, I'm gonna be taking a couple of pictures you guys can see that blowers and all that stuff I, I will do that later but this is my this is what I depend on this is why I made the bits because I have this kind of equipment thank you for watching if you like these things uh, just remember to subscribe and I appreciate you guys uh, watching. Thank you. Have a nice day.